This is a carbon fiber battery. It might hold the key to our EV future. Hey there, EV lovers. Welcome to EVpedia, your ultimate hub for everything electric vehicles. If you're as pumped about the future of transportation as we are, then you've come to the right place. We're here to bring you the latest news, reviews, and tips on all things EV. But before we dive into the electric goodness, we need your help to keep our battery charged. So, if you enjoy what you see, give that subscribe button a little love, hit the like button to show your support, and drop us a comment with your thoughts or questions. And if you're feeling extra generous, consider giving us a super thanks to help us improve and bring you even more amazing content. We promise, we read every single one of your messages. The proposed structural batteries could make EVs much lighter and more efficient. We've seen tons of advancements in the realm of EV batteries in the past few years, but this just might be one of the biggest. A startup from Sweden by the name of Sinonis has developed special carbon fibers that work as battery electrodes. The heck you say? Carbon fiber has become pretty much ubiquitous in the power sports and automotive industries thanks to its lightweight and high durability. However, this development marks a significant leap forward when it comes to producing more efficient, lighter weight batteries. Sinonis CEO Marcus Zetterstrom hopes to commercialize the carbon fiber battery technology for large-scale applications such as computers, drones, electric vehicles, and even aircraft. But at present, it's being used to replace AAA batteries in small electronics. So, what's the secret sauce behind this fancy carbon fiber battery tech? Well, for starters, apart from storing energy, this specific type of carbon fiber can also be used as structural components of machines and vehicles. Think of it as a fuel tank that's integrated into a motorcycle's frame, rather than having a separate fuel tank altogether. In this case, at least in theory, you won't need a battery housed within a motorcycle's frame. Instead, the bike's frame is the battery. Pretty cool, right? Naturally, this would mean a huge step forward in solving the weight dilemma. Electric vehicles are usually criticized for their weight, with their batteries usually accounting for a significant percentage of this. Hopefully, given this new technology, we'll soon be seeing lighter EVs, which would directly translate to longer range, faster charging times, and increased service life. Indeed, the numbers don't lie. Researchers at Chalmers University of Technology have found that using carbon fiber-based structural batteries could boost lightweight EV range by an impressive 70%. To make things even better, carbon fiber-based batteries don't contain any volatile substances, making them much safer and less prone to fires. It goes without saying that Sinonis carbon fiber battery technology could be a game-changer for the entire EV industry, not just for light EVs like e-bikes and electric motorcycles, but potentially for industrial applications like air and watercraft, too. And that's a wrap for today's episode of EVpedia. We hope you had as much fun as we did exploring the world of electric vehicles. Remember, your likes, subscribes, and comments are the sparks that keep our motor running. If you enjoyed today's video, please consider giving us a super thanks. Your contributions make a huge difference and help us deliver even better content. So, click that subscribe button, give us a thumbs up, and let us know what you think in the comments below. Thanks for watching, and stay charged. Until next time, keep it electric.